So welcome back to my channel. A quick update. I've been very busy at work, so haven't had a chance to do many videos. Uh, I've been working away on my uh, cumins, so start off with the hearth guards since they're going to be nice and easy, I thought, with a, a lot of uh, metallic. Um, so I've got uh, two points worth of hearth guards, so that's eight in total. Um, and uh, if you look at some of my older videos, you can see the green stuff work I did on them. And this is uh, them completed. So the only thing that's left to do is uh, this guy is also going to become a banner bearer. So uh, for some of the faction uh, I'm planning on using these for, it's going to be very useful to be able to equip this unit with uh, a war banner. Uh, that means that they uh, kind of get rid of their fatigue a lot easier. So uh, I'm going to just attach uh, or have a detachable flagpole on this particular model. So I can choose whether or not to do it, um, to use it for any particular game. So that's the update here. Um, pretty happy how they turned out. Um, I just every time I paint a horse, I remember how much I dislike painting horses. So I'm uh, looking forward to painting the rest of the warband at the moment. So up next are 12 levy. I've got uh, the base coat down, just using the airbrush with some zenithal highlighting. I went the uh, predictable route and split the unit into three and uh, did one dark uh, brown red base coat, one yellowish base coat and one uh, darker brown base coat. Uh, it just gives me an easy base to work off of and speeds up these models considerably especially given that they are mostly cloth so these should be a nice quick unit. It also gives me a refreshing change from painting more horses so <laughs> I've got that to look forward to. So that's it for now, just a quick hobby uh, hobby update is, uh, is all I have time for and uh, hopefully I'll get some more time and uh, be able to make some more in-depth videos. Thank you very much for watching and uh, hopefully speak to you soon.